Welcome to the Accu web hosting video tutorial. Today, we will guide you on how to add a new parked or alias domain in Jupyter C panel theme. If you want a PDF file of this video tutorial, you can download it from our Telegram channel, AccuWeb Hosting. We have mentioned our Telegram channel link in the description. Kindly click on the link and find the PDF file of this video tutorial. Before we begin, take a look at AccuWebHosting.com to review various hosting services offered by us. You can contact us through chat, phone, or send us an email at sales at AccuWebHosting.com. Let's begin the tutorial. What is Park Domain? A parked domain, also known as an alias domain, is a domain name that is associated with primary domain. In cPanel, a parked domain is a secondary domain that can be added to an existing hosting account, allowing multiple domain names to point to the primary domain. For example, if you have a website with the domain name, example.com, you can register and park the domain name, example.net, as a parked domain in cPanel. When someone types, example.net, into their web browser, it will redirect to example.com without changing the URL. The Jupyter theme has replaced the outdated paper lantern theme in cPanel and brings several updates and improvements. One of these changes is the consolidation of the add-on domains and park domain options under the new domains option. This makes it easier to manage your domains in one place. The process of adding a park domain in the Jupyter theme of cPanel is straightforward and can be accomplished by following a few simple steps. Let's see how you can add park domain in the Jupyter cPanel theme. Step 1. Log in into the cPanel account. Step 2. Locate the Domains section and click the Domains icon. Step 3. When you navigate to Domains, you need to click on the blue button at the top right with the text, Create a new domain. Step 4. To add a new alias domain in the Jupyter C panel theme, you will need to enter the domain name that you want to use as an alias in the domain text box. It is important to make sure that shared document root, home, username, public underscore HTML, with domain.tld, is selected in order to associate the alias domain with the main domain's file location. Step 5. Once you have completed these steps, click on the Submit button to add the new alias domain to your cPanel account. Congratulations! You have successfully created a parked domain in Jupyter cPanel theme. Let's quickly sum up the context of this video. We saw how to add parked or alias domain in Jupyter C panel theme. Hope, this video will be helpful for you. If you like our technical videos, please press the subscribe button and bell icon to receive instant notification of our new videos. Each like is important to us so do not forget to symbol us. To download a PDF file of this video, Please subscribe to our Telegram channel, AccuWeb Hosting, where you will have access to the PDF files of all our videos. Thank you for watching.